Hi, my name is Jacqueline Cortez. My drop box is a grocery store. It's called Super Grocery Store. The books I chose that go along with this is called Pete the Cats and the Trip to the Supermarket. And of course, just shopping with mom. These book are these books are available online. Of course, there's also the paperback versions. Um, I did want to use the online version just because it gives kids a little bit more of a chance to play around with technology and they still get to manipulate the books and go through the pages, read it, and I, I think it was pretty neat. So, in going into the actual supermarket itself, everything is completely labeled. Um, I also made teeny tiny coupons that I thought were pretty neat. Um, for example, we have 50% off corn. We have 10% off ice cream. We have $1 off of cereal and much more. I feel like the coupons and this following item, which is a shopping list, are pretty amazing to have for kids because it allows them to be interactive and look through the store, really find out what the items are and learn new vocabulary words. Um, for example, when I was a kid, I probably would have looked at this and been like, okay, it's a purple thing. What is it called? It's an eggplant. And I know that it's a vegetable. So these gro going back to the grocery list, um, it's, it's a pretty neat list. We have the egg, one box of cereal, one box of ice cream. And I think it's pretty nice because they can check off if they found the items or not. And if they didn't find the item, for example, they'll just cross it off with an X. I also have a make your own list where kids can actually attempt to make their own grocery shopping list. They can say, okay, I want to write tomato on my shopping list. They have the tomato available to try and write it out because why not? Um, like I mentioned, everything is completely labeled. We have the cash register. We have a credit card that goes with it. Um, we also have money. We have coins and cash. Um, we also have a basket. A shopping cart, once again labeled, and then our actual actual product. So we have our veggies, we have our dairy products, we have our fruit, snacks, cereals, pastas, their freezer products, and our drinks. I thought it was important for for them to learn new vocabulary words, so I use words like dairy to to group items because they might know what milk is, but then they might not know what dairy means. And dairy means any product made out of milk. So that that's sour cream, cheese, etc. So I divided it up like that. Um, and I think that's about it for my supermarket. Thank you. Ahorita voy a ver a ver.